My name is Jen, and my secret is, almost every video I film, I am wearing pajama pants on my bottom half, because I like to be comfortable. <laughs> um, hi, welcome to my Stitch Fix, which will be filmed with some very soft Christmas pajama pants on my bottom half. And I am very excited for my Stitch Fix. I requested a box as soon as I could after my last one, and didn't get a note in quick enough so I had no note on this this time so I'm assuming she just kind of went off my Pinterest and previous requests so I'm excited to see what she has here my name is Jen I do all sorts of clothing unboxing videos I am trying a high ponytail today I don't know what I think of it but I'm trying it I just got done with a week and a half long battle with the flu I'm still Still recovering energy wise I am just there I don't have a lot this is the first film video I am filming since I got sick and so if I seem low energy that is why I'm still recovering so anyways if you're new here my name is Jenna I do all sorts of clothing unboxing videos all stuff about fashion so if fashion sounds good to you then please subscribe below return viewers thank you guys so much for your continued support your comments all that really really greatly appreciate it really so if you're not familiar with what stitch fix is i will go over it super quick while i slowly get this box open it is a styling service you fill out a survey and then a stylist picks you out five items you keep what you like send back what you don't like you've got three days to make your decision you only get charged for what you keep and there's a $20 styling fee that does get applied to anything you purchase. Did I say that already? I kind of feel like I did. And then the other main thing is you get 25% off if you buy all five things, which I rarely ever do. If you want to try Stitch Fix for yourself, then look to the comments below. And if you are a Stitch Fix user, then put your referral link below. I will try to go through and approve those so others can use your referral link because I am maxed out on referrals for the month. But if you are new to it and want to try it and want $25 off of your first box and use one of the referral links in the comments below. So, what do you guys say we go ahead and get into this? Okay. The bundle. I see some animal print. So, always happy to see that. Things I never thought I would say. I really hope when animal print isn't so huge that I still really like it. Because I'm getting some animal print stuff, and I'm not going to be happy with my wardrobe if I don't like it once it's not so big as it is right now. Alright, let's start at the top. Fortune and Ivy. We have an extra small. This is the Chanis Faux Wrap Blouse in Burnt Orange. I like that. I love a burnt orange color. It's a really nice color. It's an elastic sleeve, three-quarter blouse. It has this faux wrap with a little clasp there, so that's always appreciated. And then a tie front here. Looks pretty short, so definitely something I'd probably have to wear a cami in to make sure I don't expose some midriff, but we'll see. And then in my last box, I had asked for some animal print cardias. I was really picturing like, um, you know, a long one with pockets, um, but I think this is an animal print cardigan. Yes, it is. This is by Daniel Rain. This is the Amira button-down cardigan. It is a Stitch Fix exclusive. So, not really what I had pictured in mind when I said I wanted an animal print cardigan, but we will give it a try. As the name suggests, it is buttoned down the front. Just, I think I was hoping for kind of a longer open type cardigan, but we'll see. I am always obsessed with a cream colored sweater. I don't know why. I just really like a cream colored sweater. So happy to see this. What are you? You. This is by Madison Lily. This is the Ferrica Multi Textured Pullover in Off White. And you'll see the multi-textures here in the sleeves. You've got some fuzzies, almost, I think maybe some Chanel almost. And so it is definitely multi-textured. 
It doesn't look too oversized, so if this is a good fitting sweater, this might be a keeper because I just love wearing a cream color sweater. All right, ooh, maybe this is the long cardigan I've been looking for. Ooh, I like this. This is by Cottonaporium. This is the Magic Double Front Pocket Cardigan. It's magic. Okay, so let's see this. Hold this up for you guys. This is kind of a straight down type cardigan, which is exactly the type I was looking for. Pockets. I really like this. I like this cardigan quite a bit. Very different than anything I have. Kind of the, the two-toned type animal print, which I like because it's kind of more of a subtle thing. Gray and white. I like this a lot. Okay. Now, last but not least, we have by Dictionary. And this is a... Are you a dress legging or a workout legging? I think this is like a dress legging in like a plum type color. This is the this is the Catriana Catriana um, Ponte skinny pant in dark purple. Okay, so definitely a dress legging, which I do not wear leggings to work. So most likely these will not be keepers, but we will try them on with everything anyways. It's a pull on, and, then, and this is why I wasn't sure if it was legging, because it's just straight up pull on, um, with some gathering here on the waistband. Love the color, love the dark purple. So, but yeah, I don't wear leggings to work, but I am excited to try all this stuff on. Got a couple pieces here that I'm very excited about, so um, let's get to it. All right, first up we have the cream color sweater and the purple dress leggings. Okay, so cream colored sweater. It's just kind of okay. Solely because it's just a little bit loose, a little bit big. I think I'd love it if it was just a better fit for me, but you guys have seen it here a million times. Things are just too big for me sometimes. So, I just don't think I love it enough to keep it. Now, the leggings, these are horrible. <laughs> okay, okay, I won't say horrible. These are not great. So, here's all the ways they are not great for me. First of all, I can't wear leggings to work, even if they are dress leggings. Second of all, they are a little bit too long. There's definitely some scrunching down there. And third, the waistband is actually quite too big. So it fits great around, along the rear. Waistband is too big. Here's your 360, just so you can take it all in. And uh, let's keep going. Next up we have the animal print cardigan, which is actually a really great fit. Sleeve lengths are great, you know, great fit. So great fit, that's non-issue. Like I said, we have the button up here so I don't actually have anything on our, underneath it, but let me at least undo one of the buttons. I'm just not a huge fan of this type of cardigan, which I would probably wear, you know, as a button-up type shirt, but I don't know. I'm just kind of eh about it. What do you guys think? Here's a closer look at it. 60. Like I said, good fit, just don't know that I'm overly excited about it, so let's keep going. Next up, we have the Faux Wrap Blouse. Now, I really love this color, as I said when I took it out of the box, so that still stands. The elastic sleeve is okay, it just kind of hangs open, so I think if I wanted to bring it up more, I could, but I'd probably just leave it down, I guess. So that's okay. I'm glad it has, you know, something to secure you here, but it is kind of open this way. It's a bit low v-neck wise, but I will say that the shirt length is actually better than I thought. I thought it was going to be more of a cropped look. So I wouldn't actually have to wear a cami with this unless I wanted to. So, and I'm, I probably would want it to just because it is a little bit lower, but this isn't bad, you know? I like it. I think it's a great, uh, this color that's really, 
I'm really liking. Give you guys a closer look at it. So, I don't know. I think it's a nice top. I think it's nice. Now I'm going to throw on the cardigan here. Very excited about this piece. The magic cardigan. I don't know what makes it magic, but it's magic. Maybe it's like, is it one piece? Nope, it's a cardigan. <laughs> Please don't, please don't stop watching me because I'm weird. <laughs> okay, so first impressions is again, I just think it's too big. So the sleeve legs are a little bit long, which isn't a big deal. Um, it, the pattern is the same on the back side, so I think I could easily roll it up. I wish that the sleeves, I think it's kind of meant to be a little bit oversized. So I wish the sleeves were more of a slimmer fit sleeve. I wish the whole thing was just slimmer. So I just don't know that I'm in love with it. I do like these pockets though. Um, yeah. What do you guys think of this? This, this I'm really kind of on the fence about. I don't know what I think of this. So it's definitely unique, very different than any other cardigan that I have. I love a long cardigan. So I just think if it were smaller, it'd be a whole lot cuter on me. That's where I'm at with this. So, okay, well, let's go over prices and then figure out what to keep out of these pieces. Well, if I look like I just woke up from a nap, that's because I did. I had the day off from work, and my husband got home, and he was tired. I was tired. We took a nap. So, oh, all right. Let's get into this, though. Let's find out prices. Let's decide what to keep. I did want to look at style card and see if there's anything here worth noting. Um, she did. My stylist did mention that the animal print cardigans was because I had asked for them last stitch fix last fix so I really appreciate the fact that she does remember or look at past requests and things like that it just makes me really happy and uh, even she continues to put notes in there about the band and I love my stylist so Nikki you're looking for a stylist Nikki's there all right fix number 30 how did we get here how did time fly to Stitch fix number 30. All right, so let's start at the top of my pile here. So we have from Dictionary the Katriana Ponte Skinny Pant, and these were $44, which is not bad, but um, again, just not something I could wear to work, so I am not going to keep that. The smaller cardigan, this one's really... I don't know. I have kind of mixed feelings on this. This is the Daniel Rain. This is the Amira button-down cardigan, and this is $68. So I went, I looked at this in the mirror, and I said a lot more. I liked it a lot more than I thought I did originally. I think it is a cute top, but I don't know that I $68. Love it. So I don't know. We're going to put this in a maybe pile. Then we have the blouse. This is by Buyer California. This is the Chanis Faux Wrap Blouse, and it is $40. Okay, it's in the maybe pile as well because I really like the color. That's pretty much it. Um, no, I like the color. I like the wrap style. I don't have a lot of blouses. I can throw jackets over it. So really thinking about that. Now the... This is the Madison Lily Farica Multi Texture Pullover, and it's $48. This actually, I was expecting this to be $68 because that seems to be the price of a lot of Stitch Fix sweaters. And $48, like if this had fit perfectly, I would snatch this up in a heartbeat. But since it does not, even good price or not, I'm just... I don't think I'm going to reach for it. I'm not going to be excited about it. So we'll put it in the maybe pile. <laughs> I have a hard time saying no to things. Can you figure that out yet? Okay, then last 
We have this Cotton Emporium Magic Duddle front pocket cardigan and it is $48, which is a very good price in my opinion. So if honestly guys, so first of all, I looked it up I looked in the mirror and it was huge, just way big on me. So this is definitely not happening for me. But I think it's a really, really great cardigan and if it had fit me, I would snatch this up in a heartbeat. So I'm actually really disappointed that this did not end up working out for me. But style-wise, I really, really loved that. So I don't have any heck yeses. I have three maybes. This, like I said, I liked this cardigan a lot more when I looked in the mirror. I just don't think I $68 liked it. I'm leaning towards just keeping this blouse. I rarely keep blouses, but this fit well. It really wasn't as low as I was worried it was going to be. Love the color. I'm thinking about this one, guys. So, love to hear what you guys think, what your opinions. Oh, the, the total for the whole box, $248. If you buy all five, you get 25% off, which brings it down to $62 which brings the box total to $186. So not too bad. And with the, the credit that I have left, I could actually get the whole box for 70 bucks. But I'm not gonna do that. I think maybe just keep this guy. All right, all right. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. Love to hear you guys' opinions on all these pieces. If you like this good video, please give it a thumbs up. If you are not subscribed, then please subscribe below and hopefully I will see you guys in the next video.